Hey, so what's up? I'm down here at B&H Photo. First time I'm here, and I'm in the Hollyland section. As I said, I had just gotten my Hollyland speaker, and I'm checking out their whole section here with Hollyland. This is the microphone. The receivers and video transmission. They have a whole setup here. It's really, really nice. Prices are kind of nice too. Look at that microphone. Oh, look at that price. Who's here? They also have the top of the line man photo. Um, the tripod and stuff. These are the big boy tripods. They really hold up for me quick. Right? Miller, Benpro, Benro. And then these are the cinematic cameras. I wanted to see their red cameras. So this is the red camera right here, the red digital camera. This baby, five thousand. Oh man, almost seven thousand dollars when they finish the taxes and everything. This is the cinematic camera. Like I'm on the Samsung Ultra 24, testing it out today. And what best place to test it out is V and H Photo. You have the creme de la creme of all types of camera lenses, uh, cinema lenses, broken on, Saru, the Sigma line, Hilltrop line, all the cinema cameras and all the lenses, the real tech cameras. Oh, this stuff is criminal right here. And then these are the lenses over here, but this is the Black Magic cameras. This is the Black Magic line. 6K Pro, running 2,000, 3,000 or something, you may as well say. This is the Black Magic cameras right here. Cinema camera, 6K and above. Look at these. Here right? goes the lenses on the Z cam. The back right here. Oh, look at this. I could just stand here all day and look at this. Lights, camera, action, baby. Like I said, this is the Black Magic design. And the most coolest thing about it is that I allow you to video in here. This is the small rig. So if you want to rig out your camera, it's a slider. So you want those smooth shots. This is the small rig design. This camera here is rigged out. The nice handles and stuff with all the instruments and so you don't really have to go into the settings or anything like that. All the handles and stuff are there for adjustments if you want to do. You got the handle right here in the back with the small rig. The battery. Full frame battery. The 4K. This Sony rig goes for 3,000. You may as well say 3,000 or something once they add the, the tactics. These are all the rigs right here. The small rigs that can go to your camera. You can build your, actually build your camera out. There's, you know, with the, with the um, oh, I'm excited. It's a small rig right there. You can just put your camera in here and it's handheld. You got, you know, a, 
parts that you can add on um, the monitors on the top of the rig along with the handles the easy access easy use ease of handling of your camera let's go check out Sony a minute because I need to talk to this gentleman right here for a second. Okay, back to the action. So this right here is actually a video production station. So if I was doing a production, this is the way my setup would look. I have my camera along with the monitor and everything. This is the Adam S switcher. The Magi Ninja is 149 bucks. I may just walk out of here with that. That's a good price. <laughs> the Black Magic design. The Vinci Resolve keyboard, as long as the, as well as the um, monitor. We, we, we looked at the Black Magic cameras. So now these are the monitors that you would use. This is the Ad10. Uh, SD Extreme ISO. Back up a little bit so everybody can get a look at this. The Hyper one. Hyper Deck. And this is the production center right here. This is Sirius. Got the speaker. Black Magic design, the keyboard, so you also can do your video edit, your editing with this. But look at this, look at this baby right here. Look at the nice price that goes along with it though. Like I said, that's the black magic design. So if you're doing some color grading and you're working in DaVinci Resolve and you're looking at that nice video that you want to release, this right here, it's the keyboard for it, it's the work, it's the station. It's the monitor for it. And look at the storage. Eight terabytes of storage, 1700. Well we already know that's 2000 when they come with the taxes and everything. So, we're gonna move on. Now we're bouncing in the roadcaster section. The road microphone, along with the arm. The roadcaster pro. Audio Technica in here. I think the star of this little section is the Roadcaster. Okay, this is the Sennheiser brand. The Ceremonic. The Ceremonic, they have their, their version of an all-in-one wireless mic system. The same as the um, one I have, which is the Hollyland. Yours is for 129. You can go to BGI. 
their system is running for 340 now. We've got Miami Land. Uh, they have it for 135 here. The road is 399 to 499. This right here is the solo, so you only get one mic for this one, along with the receiver to the Hobbyland. Mine is the double. I have two. I mean, two microphones with my Hobbyland setup. And this is the road. Sennheiser microphone. Nice. Go to boom hole. You want to do some um, mic extension? Your bags, your tech bags, and stuff. You can put your gear in. All the way. Magma. They were in the 69 bucks, but I don't know. Some little um, peripherals here, clips and stuff like that. They have the cables, XL, XLR cables. Okay, you know you got something for the gamers. Micro Center? I don't know, baby. You're probably coming in a distant third on this. This is number one right here. All the screen decks they have, 129, 149. The Cam Link is running for 199 here. The Mini Elgato is running for 59 here. Look at the gaming. Microsoft, the yeah. I'm sorry, Michael Center. We're going to have to put you on the pause right now. This stuff is serious. We've got a nice mechanical keyboard. A little small for, for my taste, but it's nice and heavy. Pick up for your gamers. Put this in your man cave. <laughs> Let's go check out these monitors. I'm in need of a monitor. So, I'm going to run over here and check out the monitors to see how much they're running for. And, um, let's see here. Monitors are really, really nice. The Asus. This is the creme de la creme of tech. I'm in a real tech world right now. And this is just the main floor. I haven't even gone upstairs to the second floor. I'll be going up there in a second. As soon as I finish um, checking out these monitors, because I am in need of a monitor. A new monitor. I it did state a while back that I wanted to upgrade my monitor, but I wanted to look and see the specs and see what they had before I pull the plug. So I'm going to put this on pause check this out for a minute. Right now, we're going to check out the SSD. We're going to Samsung line. This is a T7 Shield. They got the T7 running for $99, so a hundred and some change for the storage. Two shield. 109 for that. One terabyte is running 109. 115 with the taxes, I'm quite sure. We got a Seagate line. Fire cooler. 16 terabyte. That's running between 84 and 64 dollars for those. 134 with the 6 terabyte CJ line. You go to 
Microcenter. Then you're gonna have to check out Microcenter and compare. The long iron wolf. SSD. I say the long wolf because it's standing by itself. And these are the, um, the cases for them. The portable drives, these are the cases for them. The adapters and your bags and stuff to hold your gear. Check your stuff. They have a lot of stuff in here. It's the Kingston brand. And I can't leave this section without talking about the Sanders. You can't leave without talking about Sanders and their portable storage and their storage section, their professional storage, the G Drive. Rate settled for $1,999. This is the big boy range right here. This is a serious drive for professional drive. This is when you're backing up your whole household. 44 terabytes. 22 terabyte running 599. This is the G rate section. 4 terabytes running for 154. That's 154 bucks that's running for. Western Digital, Sanders, MyCloud. This is my little baby right here. 500, one terabyte is running for 109. Same as it's running for on Amazon, so I just may walk out of here with this. Makes sense to get it here. I don't have to wait for Amazon. I'll have it with me. All of this is being filmed on my Ultra 24, so hopefully the content is good, that you can hear me and everything. Hopefully the audio is good. If not, just watch the video. Some things don't need words. <laughs> this may be just one of them. May as well go to the routers now. Net here. TP Link. Anything that you want is in here. Asus. Your whole section is here. Give me a Nighthawk. Band. You're looking for the tri band, the Mi Mu technology, multiple in, multiple out. That's what you need to have. This is the Orbi. This is the tri band running for $3.99. This is the new Orbi. Motorola, they're making a little combat. This is Oomphy. Never heard of them, but. They made it in DNA Trotto, so they must be okay. Then you have your tech bags over here and all of that. Tread net. Look at your switchers. You need that extra storage space for your gear. Nice switchers. Um, let's see. 8 port running for 119, 120. May as well say 16 port running for 69. Tread net, that must be a sale. TP Lane, Aruba. Never heard of this brand. But they got an 8 port, 244. Once again, I'm still downstairs. I haven't even touched the second floor. Can't leave out our streamers. You want to write those DVD movies? You want to rip them up and DVD burner and they have all that stuff here. Mm -hmm. 
where your electrical power protectors, the surface, cyber power, this guy right here. USB charger, Vertiv, Liebert power supply, they must be out of those. Cyber power. Lights go out, don't worry, they got you covered. Gaming PCs. You want those gaming PCs? You just need a new laptop. Anything you want is here. Asus. Got the head gear for it. Words, not even necessary. Extra accessories. USB-C adapters, fans that I have a new phone now. Let me go check out their USB-C gear. I'm in need of a new um, power supply for my uh, my phone to make sure I have a portable charger with me, just in case. We go to hub. And actually, they have the docking station. Thunderbolt docking station. This runs for 300 and something on. On Amazon. So it's running the same price in here. So. This is all the Apple gear. all the Apple accessories right here. Anything you need Apple, you get it right here from the chargers on down to the, the USB-C chargers, the camera adapters, the track pads, keyboards. They have all that stuff here. Logitech brand, Alienware, Basic, Lenovo. Anything you want is here. Mini keyboards. We got a dog here over here. Look at this monitor here. Wow. This baby right here is 32. It's 32 inch. Running 3000 or something. Intel. 499 for this monitor. Quite sure you're gonna have some goodies with it with that price. They should give you something. <laughs> I don't know what it's gonna be, but the display is fire. BNH photo. We go to speaker section, the Bluetooth speakers. Check out this Marshall throwback version. Nice. Real nice. That's fire. Nice sleek design. I'm quite sure the sound is phenomenal. You have your iHome their speakers as well. This whole line of speakers right here. Earbuds, Belkin, you know they're in the house. Philips, Sony. Any type of headgear that you may want. You know you gotta have the beats in the house. Yeah, it's for sure. I'll tell you. Just for like notes and like a lot of pictures. Do you remember the throwback club, man? 
Got a digital hook. Got some music going here. Keep going. Yep. Yeah. 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 This right here is the studio headphones. You, you going to the studio with this baby here. You ain't going in the house with them. You're going in the studio. Want to get that workout on? The audio glasses. Smart glasses. Then you have your bow section, of course. I'm still on the first floor. JBL. Ah, what it says. They are to listen. Weatherproof, waterproof. You going to the party with this. And I know I said I wanted to work on my lighting for my channel. I'm just learning the lighting and stuff. Here go to Godox. This is all the lighting equipment that you will ever need. It's the Godox brand right here. And all the tools and stuff you'll need for your gear. I said, if you got that big gig going on and you're doing something like that, you're gonna need your, you're gonna need your gear. And they have everything you need here from every power supply that you will ever need. This is the Godox brand right here. The lighting. I have, I have two apps, so I don't even know. This little light right here, that's for 209. This is a cute one here. Something nice, compact, and small I'm looking for. The GVM brand. For the studio light. So They'll see me in the next century with this light, so I put this up in my house. So I just need a little small. This is the man light. Saw foxes and stuff like that. The man photo brand, once again. You know they got to have their lighting in there. Pro photo. Look at that little small light. The smaller the light is, the more it's gonna cost. This is a nice one here, but it's running a thousand or something. So. It's a nice little soft pop right here. Look at this right here. I told you the smaller the light is, the more it's going to cost. <laughs> That's understandable. Light stands and everything. Tripods and stuff to hold the lights up, the light stands and stuff like that. They got all the clamps with the boom arms and stuff. And, and then you got that nice big basement and you want to, you know, put up a green screen or whatever. These are all the clamps and the weights and stuff to hold down your gear if you're out on location. Have your gloves, your weather gloves, and stuff like that. All your clamps. Any clamp that you would need. They have it here. Okay, I can't take the excitement anymore. I'm heading upstairs to the photography department. That's why I really came here.
But uh, let me go check it out. I'll be back. Couldn't pass by this. Every activity is not going to be in the house. We're getting coming toward the summer right now. So they got their portable gear here with all their plugs and USB C's and um, USB ports and everything here. Any port you need, even down to the cigarette, the ACB light, 12 volts, 10 amps. They have everything. They are ready for any type of event that you're having. Yeah, they have it. They have you covered. Pies, more your pies and stuff that you may need. Clamps, clips. They have it all. Extension cords, all that. Give you a little quick glimpse. They have printers. All walks of life. Sony. Got their bags. These are the Leica brand. Leica lenses. Canon. Yep, they got it all. They got the bags, the camera bags. Nice. Nice. They have all the stuff. They have the Fuji. I need that, I need that, I need that. Okay, I'm going to go on a little pause right now because this is my section right here. But I'm just going to give you guys a little preview. Look at these old school cameras here. My God, look at this. This is, oh, this is how it all got started. Look at where it all started from. Look at these vintage cameras here. This is where it all started. Look at the vintage cameras. 19 what? Yeah. You already know the year right here. You just look at this. Look at this Leica here, the M6 Leica. Vintage. The lenses. Kodak. Kodak first got started. Oh man. Vintage. Look how much this was. Almost ten thousand dollars, and this is used. Who remember the Polaroid? <laughs> Who remembers this route right here? Just fold it back into the case, close it up, and you're on your way. Look at this camera here. It's a Kodak.
quite sure this is the filter for the cameras back in the day. Vintage, classic, look at this. This is where it all started from. Photography didn't just start right now. Photography started years, years, years ago. The Hasselblad brand, my media contact and icon. A lot of these brands I haven't even heard of. But the Hasselblad, I have heard of that. Relay, this is the Leica brand right here. I haven't heard of that. Best field trip ever. Okay, like I said, I was going to take a break and I'm going to go look for what I was looking for. But uh, that's uh, they have all the stuff you need. You need printers, you need any type of brand of printer that you need. Everything is here. And they do have a used section. They have all the Sony stuff here. Mm -hmm. Just gonna give a quick look around. I'm already into the 36 minute mark of the video. But I just wanna get a quick little look. This surveillance and security, they do have all of that here. So if you're looking to secure your property, your home, your office, your job or whatever, they have everything you need right here. Wi-Fi channel? Any type of this surveillance that you may need. DNH photo. So if you have one of these in your area, please go. Please go. This is the camera section right here. Any brand from the Tamron, Sigma, Newer, Lexar, Sandus, Nikon. Even the dog came to see what was on. Tripods, photo bags, Tiffin, Fuji, Tilta Small Rig, all that is up in here. Nikon, like I think I said Nikon before, but Kingston is here. This is the second level right now. I'm on the second level. So, um, I hope everybody has enjoyed this portion of uh, my trip to, my field trip to B&H Photo. I'm in Manhattan, 34th Street. Just chilling. Nice. And this right here is the home entertainment section. I'm not going to leave you with that. Peeping in here a little bit and let you see what's going on up in here. Look at this Epson screen right here. Now that's an entertainment setup right there. Array speakers. Oh, you know you got Bose, Sony, all that in the house. The throwback record player. I call them record players, that's what they are. <laughs> Best entertainment setup. Google TV in the house. Hisense in the house. You can't have your entertainment center without these brands here. The Bravia, I remember them when they first started out. So quite naturally they're going to start playing music in here now. So hopefully they're lowered so I can continue making my video. I don't want no copyright strikes or whatever the case may be. So I'm going to hurry up because, yeah, they're going to let that rock. So, yeah, so this is the home entertainment section.
We're going to bounce through, so I'm going to cut it right now because I don't want to start. Dip in before they start the music again. Injectors. So this concludes uh, this video of my trip to B&H photo. So if you have a B&H photo in your area, please go. Please go and check it out. I'm going to go do my shopping and um, pick up what I came down here to pick up. So um, got the Pelican cases to protect your gear you gotta have you gotta have protection for your gear that's real talk you gotta have protection for your gear especially if you're traveling if you're going to locations or anything like that you gotta have your protection they got the nice bags and everything for your cameras uh, video equipment they have it all here so like i said i'm getting ready to go check out and look for what i need to look for here and I hope everybody will enjoy this video. I really do. We're going to roll my setup right here along with the Jovies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And look at this. Look who's in the house. So did you sell up for that? Did you sell up? Oh, 20. We got a small rig for your camera. So if I wanted to put my camera in a small rig, I can't do so. Have one built right here all the accessories and stuff like that. Real nice. The gimbals, the stabilized gimbals is here. DGI, the Osmo gimbal. We got the GB, DGI department. You know they got the drones in the house. All that is here. So, like I said, I'm getting ready to go and check out my stuff. Hope everybody will enjoy this video when I do get it ready and post it. And I um, hope the audio will be nice and everything. You go to the drone section. So once again, Lady Media, I'm out. Fade to black.